Vinod Kambli debuted in Test cricket against England at Eden Gardens, Kolkata, on 29th January 1993. His last Test match was against New Zealand at Cuttack on 8th November 1995. Vinod Kambli debuted in ODI cricket against Pakistan at Sharjah on 18th October 1991. His last ODI match was against Sri Lanka also at Sharjah on 29 October 2000. Vinod Kambli played 17 test matches, 21 innings, and scored 1,084 runs with a terrific batting average of 54.0. His highest score of 227 against Zimbabwe at Delhi in 1993 helps India to win the match by an innings and 13 runs. Without any doubt Vinod Kambali was declared man of the match in that test. He hits four centuries, including two double centuries, and three half centuries along with six sixes in his entire test career. As a fielder he took seven catches. Vinod Kambali played 104 ODI matches, 97 innings, and scored 2,477 runs in his entire ODI career with a decent batting average of 32.59. His ODI strike rate is 71.94. His highest ODI score of 106 against Zimbabwe at Kanpur in the Wills World Cup 1996 helps India to win the match by 40 runs. He hits two centuries and 14 half centuries in his entire ODI career along with 20 sixes. As a fielder, he took 15 catches. Vinod Kamali had an outstanding first-class record. He played 129 matches, 181 innings, and scored 9,965 runs with a sensational batting average of 59.67. His highest score in first-class cricket is 262. He has 35 centuries in his kitty. In list A cricket, Vino Kambali played 221 matches, 204 innings, and scored 6,476 runs with a very good batting average of 41.24. He has 11 centuries in his kitty. Born and bred in Mumbai, Vinod Kambali's flashy stroke play, flamboyant personality and fondness for gold jewellery was more West Indies than West India. A precocious talent, he was 17, and Sachin Tendulkar 16, when they put on a world-record unbroken 664-run partnership in a school match. Kambali started his test career three years after Tendulkar and three years after he had hit the first ball he received in the Ranji Trophy for six. But what a start it was, in his first seven tests, he racked up to double centuries and to single ones. His footwork was dazzling against the spinners he once smashed Shane Warne for 22 runs in an over, but he often got himself into a tangle against the short ball, and his flash to gully soon became a trademark. Kambali's problems were compounded by indiscipline and an obsession with the width of his bat handle, which had nine grips on at one time. He made as many as nine comebacks into the one-day team, but played his last test in 1995 before he had turned 24. He wasn't picked in the Indian ODI team after October 2000 and retired from international cricket in 2009. He announced his retirement from first-class cricket in 2011.